Feeding cats in the, in Spain is illegal. Um, I believe it carries up to a fifteen hundred euro. Uh, sorry, a five hundred euro fine. Um, I know from where I am why I could, why these things are in force because we've got a neighbour that feeds these feral cats, wild cats. These cats were, I believe, originally instated to keep vermin control down. Um, if you feed the cats, they stop hunting, they start breeding. And originally we started with about three last year, and we've got at least seven now, and I could hear yelping of more kittens. Now, I know everyone goes, oh, but these poor lovely cats, they're, they're actually there as wild animals they're not there as pets as such feeding them makes an excess population like i said they're just sitting around because this woman leaves all this cat food in the street and it goes all mank it gets wet she doesn't clean it up she just puts more there um there's cat crap everywhere now when i say everywhere i'm not on about because cats are normally pretty clean but when you've got seven cats that are sitting at a doorstep day in, day out, waiting for food, they're pretty stinky. Um, also, where they originally come from, which is a construction site uh, a bit further along, there's cat crap all the way around there. They've crapped in all the um, empty shop win windows because you've got like a shutter between the doors and windows. They've crapped all over the place. And this is why I can understand why somebody would actually say, right, 500 you are fine. Don't you feed these bloody animals? Because at the end of the day, they were put there for a purpose. Now, I understand there's a lot of wild animals here that simply um, have dead owners or been thrown out. Because I think some of the hunting dogs, for example, people post pictures of them being dumped somewhere or even attempted to have them killed, etc. So... I can understand from my animal welfare point of view, but if you're going to feed them, you need to neuter them. Now, I know charities say, oh, we neuter all these animals. Of course they do. That's why these ones outside my house are breathing like no tomorrow. Um, the interesting thing here is if the police get involved, they can be quite... Um, quite specific um because like i said 500 euro fine if you feed them i don't know if anybody's actually had this fine but i do know somebody that had about 10 cats or something they were all wild she was feeding them and the police got involved because the neighborhood environment wasn't happy with them and the local government said look you've got to stop feeding these things we don't want them you know they're they're a liability they're um you know, their feces and everything's quite disgusting. So they agreed. Yes, uh, we're going to stop feeding them. Okay, then, you'll have to kill the cats. Shock horror. An animal lover being told that they have to kill all the cats that they've been feeding. I don't know what happened with the cats after that, whether a charity dealt with it or not. But the fact is, just if you're going to feed them, new to them. That's all I'm saying. Because then at least if somebody does bother you saying, are you feeding those cats? And you go, yes, but I also pay to new to them. There's the paperwork. That way, at least they'll leave you alone. The problem I've got, like I said, is there was three, then there was seven. Now, I don't know, don't know how many there is. And the thing is, they're only being fed there. They're not brought into the house. They're not house cats. They're not domesticated cats. These are cats that were, I assume, put there to just kill rats and mice in the area and they're not doing it they're just sat around doing nothing all day and most of the evening they spend night under nice warm uh, cars where the engines have been running they're certainly not hunting um, because they're getting so much food they've got excess food the food is going like getting left in the main road because what happens is is she leaves this tub down and then it ends up scattered everywhere and nobody's clean it, clean it up. Nobody's cleaning all the crap cat up. Uh, crap cat up. Crap cat crap up because nobody takes responsibility for it. So we've got to feed them. Take ownership of the animals. Don't just dump food there um, because you're creating a bigger problem. 
And okay, you may be an animal lover, but be aware that we're most people are animal lovers, but it doesn't mean that we encourage excess breeding, etc. And even if you're feeding them, just keep it within a moderation. You don't have to put a kilo down every time you feed them. Um, all right, thanks for watching. Yeah.